here there's three different bits and here over here we have triple square or 12 point bits and then we have star bits or torx bits and hex bits or allen keys so the, there's slight differences between them but they're major if you are taking out bolts you would definitely strip them out if you're using the wrong size here you can see if you look straight on it's basically just three squares stacked at each other so this is a triple square and see this here fits an old head bolt off the car and it's important if you were to put a torx on that that kind of fit then you would definitely strip it out so it's important not to mix these up and here this is what a torx bit or a star bit looks like you can clearly see the six points and that fits right on there to the T30 size, and that's how they're measured. Here we have all the hex bits or the Allen bits. This, these are the same ones that you would have in your Allen key set, except they're a little bigger. And there's six points right there, and they fit on just like. We have one of the Torx bits and a triple square screw. So if we put that on, you can see that it fits. It kind of feels like it's seating, but there's only six points on this torque and where this is made to be taken off with 12. This is definitely where it gets confusing because you'll put it in, you think it fits, and then when you try to take it off, you'll just strip all the uh, little points off there. Around Here is the triple square right next to the hex bit or the Allen keys, and that fits, it looks like it fits really nicely until you strip it out and round out all the corners. Just because you're able to get a triple square to fit doesn't mean you should use it. Just always make sure you use the right tool for the right job. Squares are normally more common on German cars like Audis or Volkswagens, but they're not very common in like normal tool stores like Harbor Freight. You actually have to go to a like an auto parts store to be able to get this bit. End of these triple square 12 points, you can fit into a socket or a combination wrench to take out bolts. These will fit into some really tight places. So these three bolts might look the same, but they're definitely not. Make sure not to get them mixed up. So if you guys found this explanation useful, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.